Welcome back to Living Local. The Miss Iowa Scholarship Program is a competition that works to provide scholarships to enhance educational and career opportunities for young women. Miss Iowa 2018, Michaela Hughes Shaw, originally from Rock Island, was a guest on Living Local several times during her year of service. Michaela recently passed her crown on to Miss Iowa 2019, Emily Tinsman. She now joins us in studio. Uh, thank you so much for being here, Emily. Thank you for having me. And congratulations on thank being crowned you. Miss Iowa 2019. <laughs> and a great thing to know, too, Emily is also from the Quad Cities. So for the past two years, yes. represent the Quad Cities. Uh, so first of all, Emily, uh, what was the experience like of going through the competition and then ultimately winning the crown? Well, I've been a part of this program for the past three years. So really, it was a big learning experience, a chance to get involved in my community, a chance to develop professional skills that would prepare me post-graduation. And ultimately, this year, I went into it. I was like, I am just going to go in. I'm going to be myself. Mm -hmm. I'm going to be Emily Tinsman and somehow walked away with the title of Miss Iowa. Wow, that's an incredible story. So tell us a little bit about your background. We know that you're from Bettendorf, mm -hmm. but what else can you tell us? Well, I recently graduated from Drake University in May, so that's only been a month, but <laughs> it feels like it's so much has happened since. Mm -hmm. Other than that, I am an advocate for music and arts education. Mm -hmm. I was initially going to be a music teacher after Miss Iowa, but that is now on hold mm -hmm. as I begin my year of service. Wow, so exciting. So uh, you mentioned uh, what your values are, but mm -hmm. what is your Miss Iowa social impact statement? So like I said, I am a huge advocate for arts education and my social impact is called Tempo's Arts Education Advocacy. So really my goal is to make sure that kids have artistic experiences and opportunities and making sure that they have access to those programs without the worry of finances. Mm -hmm. A lot of families when it comes to the arts aren't able to support their children because of that financial burden put on families. And through Tempos and through Becoming Miss Iowa, I'm going to be able to start a scholarship fund to allow kids to have those opportunities. Oh, that's incredible. Why do you think it is so important for kids to have access to those programs? Being that involved in arts, you begin to realize that there's so many important outcomes of being in music mm -hmm. and art and dance and all these different outlets. You build self-confidence, you become more self-aware, what's going on around you, you're culturally aware, you develop skills like you would in math or science, and it really helps you to just develop in a well-rounded education and that's why I'm a huge advocate. Yeah, I could not agree more. I know that I've been involved in dance and chorus mm -hmm. in high school and theater. It's just incredibly, yeah, like you said, a very mm -hmm. positive experience. I and mean, actually, your talent for Miss Iowa plays into that social yes. impact statement. So uh, what was your talent? My talent is opera. Wow. So <laughs> I like to sing those high notes. Yes, <laughs> oh my goodness. So uh, what do you enjoy about the opera? So. I didn't really get involved in the classical music scene until I went to college. I went to school for music education and I didn't even realize that it's all about classically training your voice, mm -hmm. building technique and I began to realize, okay, opera's kind of cool. Mm -hmm. It's this very unique outlet that combines theater, that combines movement and music and I got to bring that love of classical music to the Miss Iowa stage and now the Miss America stage, which is pretty crazy to say. Well, my goodness. Okay, so that is another question that I have is how, what, oh, so you won Miss Iowa mm -hmm. crown. So now then what's the next step of preparing for Miss America? So the next step is continuing to perfect my talent as much as I can, getting out into the community and showcasing my platform or my social impact initiative and really just preparing myself for that environment. At the end of the day, it is a competition, but at the end of the day, I'm excited to meet 50 women from around the country and DC and make lifelong friendships with other women who are so passionate about the organization and community service. And what's the timeline look like? When is the competition? So that is to be determined. Oh, gotcha. We should find out here in the next couple of weeks. So I'm waiting as much as you're <laughs> waiting. And it will likely be in the winter and it will be airing on NBC this year. Wonderful. Okay, so what does wearing that crown mean to you, Emily? 
I never even thought I would even be able to answer that question or have this crown on my head. But having this title, being Miss Iowa, means that I can impact as many kids as possible throughout the state of Iowa when it comes to music, when it comes to arts. But at the end of the day, I just want to be a role model for young women and showcasing to them that anything is possible. The, you may have crazy dreams that involve being involved in Miss Iowa. It may be in, a teacher, whatever that may be, knowing that their ambitions are achievable. And what will you be up to during your year of service? I will be hopefully getting out into schools, the school tours in the works, making sure that I'm reaching as many kids, administrators, and legislators as possible to showcase, again, why the arts are so important and showcasing why the Miss Iowa Scholarship Program is relevant in our society today. That's awesome. Well, thank you so much for being thank here. You very and much. again, congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> All right, for more information, you visit missiowa.com. We'll also have these details posted on ourquadcities.com. More Living Local continues after this.